around our age of 22, I've realised that sometimes people don't always tell the truth. Now I'm not talking about little white lies here. Isn't this so much better than playing the Xbox? Uh-huh. I hope you've not broken my laptop. No. See, when you get a group of people together, particularly when there's males and females involved, certain people try and impress others. That's understandable, in a big group of people, everyone wants to impress slightly. Some say funny jokes, some dress nicely, I put my chocolate bar down. It's when people make up massive lies, mainly to impress someone of the opposite sex. Girls will say stuff like, I naturally have no body hair anywhere. Ew, I never fart, ever. Of course you fart! Actually, it's biologically impossible not to fart ever, so why make that up? And when guys go, I did it with 15 girls last night, just saying. Did you? Did you really? But you were posting on Facebook all last night. Yeah. At the same time. And you look around the room and you can see people thinking it over and the look of worry on their faces. I fart sometimes. Is there something wrong with me? I don't even know 15 girls. And quite frankly, all this bullshit just messes up people's ideas of the opposite gender. If no one talks openly and honestly with each other, then how are we gonna ever learn anything about anyone? So I couldn't give a shit or anything, but like, do you wanna go out? Maybe you couldn't give a shit, like whatever. Whatever, couldn't give a shit. Yeah, I'll probably find like a different boyfriend tomorrow, but like, whatever, yeah, fine. Yeah, I'll probably have a booty call tonight anyway, couldn't give a shit. Yeah, do I care? Couldn't give a shit though, like, but whatever, like, are we, are we still going out? Yeah, do I care? Whatever, like, yeah, couldn't give a shit. See you later. Yes! See, all this rubbish that certain people say? I believed when I was younger. I believed that people were having five orgies in the morning before school, and that some of my girlfriends at the time had 15 boyfriends at once, and that people were snorting crack cocaine before they did their homework that evening. Turned out it was all lies. And initially I was a little bit panicked because I wasn't doing this and I'd never had a boyfriend. But then I realised I had my Game Boy. Doo -doo -doo, doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> this is better than having a boyfriend. And this didn't actually improve at uni. Someone once listed all the public places that she'd had sex at in one night. But then I actually realised that it was physically impossible to get to all those places in the same night. But seriously, why are you lying to impress guys? And then these types of people are the first to complain when they confuse someone of the opposite gender. Oh my god, last night you tried to get it on with me on a park bench? What a dickhead. What a sicko, where did you got that idea from? I know! So, let me know if you've had the similar experience and if you've ever believed what you've heard in the past. Thank you for watching, I hope you're well. Let me know your opinion in the comments below and I'll try my best to reply and I hope you're well. That's all from me. Bye! I know, I can't believe it myself. No body hair anywhere and it's all natural. What about the hair on your head? Oh, yeah, well apart from this, like, no body hair anywhere else. Right, so why do you have this then? Yeah, that's for decoration.